I'm Stefan Argus and I'm from Chicago, Illinois. From a very young age, I started singing around the house, just humming, and my sisters would be like, shut up, Stefan, and I'd be like, no, this is what I'm, this is my dream. <laughs> I'm gonna do this for real. <laughs> and I started taking lessons for singing, and then Spanish guitar, and then it was a snowball effect with, um, you know, cello, French horn, I taught myself the ukulele, mandolin, banjo. My introduction to the entertainment industry was when I was around 11. I started doing musical theater and I really wanted to do TV and film, so I got an agent out in Chicago. And one of my first auditions was for this musical franchise called Kids Bob, and then I booked it. And my life kind of turned upside down from that point. Hey baby, what you gotta say? All you're giving me is fiction. We ended up doing two countrywide tours and we did some shows in Canada and we traveled to the Bahamas filming so I was all over the country in North America and you know I've been writing since I was 10 so I had a lot of music that was kind of like backed up and I was ready to get it out there and so around the age of 15 is when I started pursuing my own solo music career so uh, I moved to Los Angeles and I started working as an actor and I started working with producers and writing with people and I was so anxious to get music out, and I finally did that a couple years ago at this point, just when I released my first song. Throw yourself back, you were better back then, but then you started to play dumb and you started to pretend. And it's been an amazing journey so far, having that out and doing live concerts and recording an EP, and now I'm working on recording my first full-length album, which I'm so excited about. One thing that I've had to kind of come to terms with being in this industry, specifically acting, is there's a lot of rejection. There's a lot of no. There's a lot of auditioning and putting your heart and soul into a specific project and then getting it shut down. And that happened to me. I filmed this pilot. I was so excited about it. It was so much fun. It had an amazing cast, an amazing crew, and I was super excited about it. The role was perfect, you know, it was like a rocker kid and it ended up getting reworked and so the pilot didn't go forward uh, the way that it was originally planned so I was no longer a part of it which was really hard for me that was like getting so close and it felt so real so it's everything happens for a reason and it's really hard to understand that when you're in the moment but it leads you towards exactly what you're supposed to do and what you're meant to do and what I feel like is best for me and I'm so happy with where I'm at right now on social media in particular, I feel like people try very hard to portray a certain idea of themselves. I am a weird guy, and I feel like a lot of people are weird, you know, behind closed doors. And I'm not saying that you should put every, you know, ounce of your being on the internet, but I'm just saying, like, I'm not this, like, perfect person who's, like, cool and aesthetic and, like, I just, like, make music and I'm so cool. I'm just also really strange, and I like to dance, and I like to be weird, and I'm not trying to hide that from anyone. So in school, I was bullied a lot for wanting to be that way, wanting to embrace these weirder parts of myself. I thought, okay, well, now I'm just an outcast. I'm isolated, and I feel like I have nowhere to turn. But the thing is, those people, they find each other. So if you believe you know, like, this is who I am, this is who I'm going to be. The people who accept and love that, they're going to find you, and you're going to find them, and you're going to love them for who they are. And it's even more beautiful than if you tried to suppress whatever you were feeling and just be like, you know, like the other people because you feel like that's what you have to do. And it's really important to understand and remember that you are going to find those people that you vibe with and who will love you exactly the way you deserve in exactly the way that you will love them. That's a beautiful thing. I'm Stefan Argus, and you are so beautiful now.